right, so right. like how do like like Oof, how do you ask your girl for bread ah uh, you don't ask your girl for bread i don't think that's so. how you do it yeah you gotta f- fuck he's asking me g blood exchange how do you ask your girl for bread you you don't ask your girl for bread you try your hardest not to i mean you, yeah you try you need this to. bread like like you never ask her for the bread what I keep saying, I keep saying, I keep saying, yeah. you don't ask her for no bread. Yeah. Because if you tell her the situation, she's mm-hmm. going to say, here's the bread. Yeah. A good shorty's going to be like, here's the bread. A good shorty's going to be you like, never hey, ask her, a- you never have to ask your girl for bread. She asks you, what's wrong? You tell her what's wrong, mm-hmm. and she volunteers she presents, it. She presents That's it. what a good girl but does. But then, then a good nigga should be open and honest about what's going on so she knows what's going on. No, so yeah, gotta of course. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. You, That's got to be the nigga's ask. part yeah. on that. You, you don't ask because you don't ask your girl, hey, babe, I need some money. <laughs> no, you don't ask your girl for bread. You tell her what's up and then if she's good, she tells you, here, how much is it? And you're like, yo, don't worry about it, shorty. She's like, yo, how much is it? I'm like, yo, I'm good. Hello, hello, Lila. Hello, hello, Lila. Shia, you good? Yeah, yeah good. man. Everybody good? Yeah. I think so. Uh, uh-huh. Welcome back to the to the Blunt Exchange. Oh, uh, uh, episode. Turn my mic up. Turn my mic up. Turn the mics up. What episode mm. is this? Episode twenty four. Oh, the Kobe episode. Kobe episode. Got my purple on. Shout out to Kobe. Shout out to Kobe. Shout out to Kobe. Oh, I thought you was gonna wear your purple Shout today. Shout out to Kobe. Shout out to Kobe. You wearing purple? Yeah, no purple G. I mean, you got it. You had it. You had it. Kobe uh, episode. Rest in peace. Uh, we did it. Kobe uh, being brown. Got, got the gold hair. Got the hair. You feel me? Yeah, man. Kobe was a he was a great player, man. One of the greatest of all time. Great person. Mm-hmm. Did a lot of great things for a lot of people. Mm-hmm. Great role model. Mm-hmm. And he was taken way too soon, man. So yes. Rest in peace to Kobe Bryant. Once again. But another day. And with. Like I said before, I'm your host. Yes. And Gunner. Yes. And to my left. Woo. My, one of my co-hosts, one of my guys from the sandbox. You dig? Mm-hmm. Crump. Yo. Let's go. A.K.A. Ladies. Crump Diddy. Woo. A.K.A. Dexter. AKA, listen, I'm there's been a little here. bit of a controversy around yeah, this. Man, we he mailed wants these in. Me to drop vibes. Serial killer. Yeah, but not, I love it. I'm not even a. That's I how you come off to some people. Who? To who? You, <laughs> who are these people? They tell me. Please the send viewers, that in. They come to Anybody? me, they tell me. <laughs> they DM me. They, they say DM you? you come off in you? some of these <laughs> scenarios insensitive. Emotionless and it gives them serial killer vibes. I'm not jacking that. Nope, you're not jacking I'm it. I'm not jacking that. They just said you, you just don't have enough uh, emotions in I do certain have a, situations. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a human being. Yo. Because you know your la- one of your last blood. AKAs, your second to last AKA is paper over people. Oh, nah, 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 he's PMP. Nah, 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 nah. And the last one, AKA William H, the all time great. How was I mean, your weekend, brother? <laughs> Yo, it was That's good. Not fair. It was good. My weekend was good. It was cold outside. Kept it in the, kept it indoors a little bit. Yeah. But I mean it was it was chilling. I thought you loved the cold weather. I mean, nah, I don't not anymore. I, I remember growing anymore. up with you, yeah. you used, we used to call you the polar bear. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, I, don't, I don't Because I don't like you would have the windows bear. down mm-hmm. in the, in weather just like this. Okay. Or AC in the crib. I mean top down in the winter. That's, That's what, what winners, winners do. do. I feel hey. Hey. I hear you. I hear you. I mean So good week. Yeah. yeah Any plans week. for the weekend? Uh, you know, no, not right now. No, okay, no, no, okay. No, 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 well, no. I'm glad that you're doing well, brother. I mean, good luck. Yes, sir. Uh, to my right, I have hey. the one. Uh oh, I forgot. The only. Uh oh, I forgot. Uh, you got something you gotta say? My fault. Oh uh, no, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. Well, tomorrow is, or I guess, you know, I mean, the day. Yeah. So it's my birthday. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Tomorrow's my birthday. <laughs> I thought you didn't want to mention it. I, I was going to go past it. Oh, man. Let's I, go, I, man. Happy I, birthday, Crumb. Yo, good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Birthday threesome. Birthday threesome. Birthday threesome. So you, nah, so nah, you no, really birthday, have nothing to do? No birthday. birthday. Have you asked it just for the birthday threesome? 
Birthday threesome, birthday threesome, birthday threesome. I don't want the birthday threesome. All right. No? No, I don't want it. Okay. You sure? Yeah, I'm good. Damn it. That's not that's not my steez. That's not your cup of tea. That's not my cup of tea. Yeah. Okay. All right, all right. Spend it with my lady and, you know. Hey. See some family. Okay, I feel that's you. Always Listen, better. Look at, that's look at, always better, man. Look yeah. at you, smooth. You, go, smooth. you got some tips for us on how to keep a lady later on? Mm-hmm. Uh, we'll see. Okay, we'll that's see. good. We'll to see. the right, I have the one, wow. the only. Thank you. Pablo, <laughs> a.k.a. Bleak, a.k.a. Made by Pablo. Hey. Oh, wow, that's a new one. A.K.A. Hey. DJ Wavy Seal. Hey. <laughs> A.K.A. I'm not letting no pussy pass no. me. Uh, I gotta uh, smash it because I'm that guy. What? What do we do? What do you tell him? What do you tell him? What do you tell him? Get you your tell ticket. Him? What you tell him? Get, Get your, your ticket. ticket. Get your ticket. Easy pass only. Hey. Okay. I might go for the subscriptions now. Oh. I might, get I might open that up for y'all. Would you like get to give ready. us? Would you like to give us your Snapchat? Oh no, not yet. It's not ready yet. The premium's not ready yet. The premium's not ready. I'm gonna get it after Christmas. I'm gonna get people get their. How money was your out. week? How was your week? My week was great. Been watching a lot of TV. Mm. I didn't watch Power though, so I feel like I let wow. the team down. Wow. Oh, so we'll give power. you the Power update next week. Yes. We'll catch yeah. up everything on Power and give you the update next week. But that was taken by this new show, Selena. Selena, how's oh, that going? How's that going? I'm four episodes and a half in. Do you love it? I don't love it, but it's not as bad as social media says. Uh-huh. Is it better than uh, J-Lo? No, Selena? nothing's better than J-Lo. Social media lies a lot. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Can't yeah, they listen do. to everything social media says. They do, yeah. But, you know, it was so much. It just came out of nowhere. It was just so much. It was just such negativity. So much hate? So much hate for this girl. What Why? Was her accent off or something? Yeah. No, her accent is off. She can act. Does she look she like does. Selena? She does. The, she has a lot of the mannerism. She doesn't look like her. Not that much. Mm -hmm. But the girl has a spark. If you could cast uh, it, for the Selena cheap? role. Does it look it? like it was a no, cheap? No, it's not. Okay. It doesn't right. look cheap at all. Though. All everybody that's on that show are good actors. They, everybody's doing a good job so far. Like I said, I'm only four episodes in. If you could cast. For the Selena, if you could cast for the Selena movie, uh, who would you pick to play Selena? Jennifer Lopez. Jennifer Lopez thinks she'd be a good Selena? Forever. That's my Again? Girl. That's my wife. Sure did it. That's my life. Jello. Isn't she considerably older now? Wouldn't she have she wouldn't have the same Jello? Who yes. considerably older? Did you now. did we not just see her as a stripper like a year ago? Wasn't she like the, the boss or something? Yeah, she yeah, wasn't like a the stripper. Boss stripper. She was the boss stripper. All right. All right, man. Jennifer, hot Jennifer Lopez mm, takes. Yeah. You can mm, always expect mm, them mm, here. Love it. Love it. Love it. Jesus. Yeah. Shout yes. out. Yeah. And I'm your host, hey. Eddie Gunner. Yeah. AKA hey. Gregory Hines, the great dance legend. Yes. AKA tap, tap, Horsepower, tap. Horsepower. AKA Low Ooh, Life. What was it? AKA, <laughs> <laughs> AKA <laughs> The Real Gunner. Um, tap. Guys. Tap, tap, tap. 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 What are we doing today? The yeah, blunt man. exchange. Keeping it blunt? You want to clean up blunt. anything yeah, from last man, week? Let's light it. What the fuck? Yeah, do we, do we got to clean up? Do we, do we say anything crazy? Yeah, fuck that, man. Fuck that. Nah, light nah, it. Nah, we love you guys. If there's anything that we got to uh, correct or go back over, don't forget to hit us, hit us up on all platforms. Yes. Twitter, Blunt Exchange, mm -hmm. without the E. Okay. Facebook, Blunt Exchange, without the E. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Spotify, man. Apple Podcasts. What else we on? YouTube. YouTube. Twitter. Now you're watching us. You definitely know we're on YouTube. YouTube. Please, please hit the like bell and the notification Yeah, because most of our views are, yeah. they don't just subscribe. I don't understand that. You like our yeah. show, you come back and but you, you watch every week, bell. but you don't subscribe. Come you through don't for the, the swag. Just, just press the like button. It's that easy. And we got a lot of good stuff coming up. No one has won the Hennessy contest yet. That bag is still up for grabs. Come Yo, on, guys. I'm going to take it. It's a yeah. Henny bag. Yeah. I'm going to take guys, it. Yeah, another week. We'll I figure something it. out if you guys don't want that. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. <laughs> Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. <laughs> got Tuesday, it. Yes. Tuesday, We're going to flip for this, bro. That ass. Yeah, real talk. I need that book bag. Real talk. How was your weekend, G? My weekend was amazing. I think I spent time. Yeah, I spent some time with my son. Which is always amazing. Okay. Family time okay. is always okay. great, okay. and you know you gotta, you know you gotta be there for the youngins. Yes. If the big dogs die, who gonna feed the pups? Ooh. Ooh. You know what I mean? So we like came with mm, knowledge. Hey, we came with wisdom. Wisdom. Yeah. Nah, I can't take credit for that. that was Jada. Oh. Uh, but you know you gotta, you know you gotta give a, you gotta give a pieces of yourself to the little ones so they can, you know, learn. Yeah. They can build off of it and take it to the next level. Really, you don't want to yeah. just hold the game on a chokehold, keep it to yourself. No. No? No, man. Sure. I got to give it all to my son. So you don't want to hold the bull by the horn? Teach me the game, Ghost. <laughs> Teach me the game. Like, um... But then you got to kill your dad. Damn. I mean, hey, man. If I, if my <laughs> life can make him go to where he needs to be, 
then it's okay. You shouldn't be talking about power. How dare you? How dare you? You didn't even watch you, it. Bleak. Let me want it's to back. back. I'm sorry. Word of the day. Word of the day. Oh, word of the day. Not only can you get high, you can learn something. Higher learning. All right, today's word of the day is uh, epitome. The word of the day is epitome. Epitome? Epitome. Can I can I get that in a sentence? Jesus Christ, I hate you, Bleak. Why am I? She looked... The epitome of elegance and good taste. Oh. Ooh. You want to go first? You, you go first, Blake. The epitome? She looked like... Can you repeat that? <laughs> she looked the epitome of elegance and good taste. Hmm, like the most? Like, she looked... Like the top. Like, like the top? The, like, the most attainable, the most aspirational, yeah. like the like, pinnacle. Like, at the know, top of the hill. You know, the... The uh, most. Pinnacle, you say? Like yeah. the pinnacle? Yeah, like the The, pinnacle. the, you know, the, the, the greatest. Top. The greatest? Yeah. Guess the what, baddest. guys? The when baddest. you guys try, mm, you get it right. You dig? I'm oh. a very leniently. I'm very lenient on how I grade because I know that the wow. intent of what you're saying, you understand the definition. Wow. So, epitome. It's a noun, mm -hmm. a person or thing that is the perfect example of a particular Perfection. quality of or type. Okay. The pinnacle, the yeah. epitome, the top, uh. the cream of the crop. Uh -huh. yeah. uh. If you want to talk about basketball players, LeBron James, James. is the epitome. Uh, Conejo Malo, right now, the top of the game. Of current players, current, yeah. correct. Michael Jordan is the epitome of every of single player of all time. Why are we talking yeah. about players that played 25 years ago? Because they're still the best. Wow, somebody, somebody stuck in the past. Um, so, no. epitome. Use that in your uh, everyday uh, vocab. I will. In your lexicon, and then you yeah. could take it to the next level, guys. You too can be the smartest one in the room. All right. <laughs> I like next, that one, G. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Current events. Let's get Run it. Run Woo! Run what happened? Did you guys see this video of... Um, that shit happened, bro. Kevin Samuels. That's his yeah. name? Yeah, that's his name. Kevin it's been Samuels. flowing around social media. He's that really way. harsh with this uh, young lady who's wondering why she can't find uh, a top-earning professional, successful male to... Uh, to to be romantic with, to be in a relationship with, to vie for her. But uh, she's a uh, love. Let's take a look, look, quick look at it. Real quick. I honestly want a, a six figure guy. Uh, is what I'm realizing. Okay. And ma'am, and that's my point. You ladies all feel like listen. You ladies all feel like you're the exception to the rule. And then when someone like myself comes along and gives you a a dose of reality, instead of just accepting it, it's like yeah, but. Yeah, but I'm special. You don't know any men on this level that are not your father, that aren't related to you. That means you don't know these men. You don't know where to go get them. You don't know what they want. But you're still saying, pick me. They don't want mid-30-year-old baby mamas. So, how do you? what do you guys think about that? Huh? Yeah, man. That's very so harsh. It's harsh. It's too harsh? Harsh. It's harsh. Well, like, harsh. I mean, you like call them. But is he telling her up. truths? I mean, yeah. Nah. Are these truths? Yeah, yeah, yeah. His yeah, truths, yeah. maybe. But his ahead, truths, right? Ahead, his oh. truth, yeah, yeah, I agree. His truth, not yeah. the truth. Yeah. His, uh, it, what he believes to mm -hmm. be, you know, the reason why he can't really, uh, he can't, she can't get the, the guys he's ult she's ultimately trying to get. Yeah. Like, uh, like the stuff he said when it comes to like you don't make that much money so you're not in the circles to interact and just to like you know know how to attract somebody who's very very there's successful. some truth in that that's some, that's some horrible yeah. shit to say to somebody like he also said that you're not you know, that then you're not attractive you thing is tough it's tough to hear that right you're average looking but she rated herself Jesus so I that's mean, a self confidence that's, thing that's, too no that's just what would you rank yourself on a scale from one to ten you cannot use seven would I rate myself just your face. Um, my face when I wake up five, but when I put myself together six. Fucked up. I think she didn't want to like. I think she didn't want to play herself. So she. Was, I think. I think honestly, I feel she was trying to lower her. Lower, Let me ask you a question. Herself for like, if you had to rate yourself from one to ten, what would you oh, rate yourself? Come on, what is that? I'm a four. I mean, I'm a zero. I don't know why I said four. I'm a zero. Okay. You would rate yourself a zero, sir? No, I don't know what I would rate myself. If you can rate yourself from one to ten myself. and you can't use seven, what would you rate I yourself? I have no idea. Yeah, you see how tough that question is? How much of an asshole that guy? No, that's, that's an mean, asshole shit yeah. to say to someone. If, yeah. Bleak, if you have to rate yourself from one to ten and you can't use seven. Ten. Spontaneous ten. Without a doubt. I look at myself in the mirror every day. And you say perfection. Perfection. 
It couldn't be any better. Mm -mm. There's nothing you would change. Nope. Every hair is in its place. Yeah, man, that guy's an asshole. Your features, perfect. <laughs> yeah, that guy's an asshole. It's his truth, like Crump said and everything. But damn, you choose a number, but not seven? Yeah, because seven is like, nah, it's right there. I it's get like it, a, she was it's like a hedge. What do, you, what, do you, a hedge. what do you give yourself? One to ten, but no seven. That was hard. <laughs> oh, we only going up to ten? <laughs> there we go. I'll take you a hundred. You got to have confidence in yourself. A, a, but at the same point in time. You're a dime? Give yourself a dime? <laughs> Baby, a dime? I'm the whole stack. Uh, Fuck it. I'm the, I'm, the, I'm the rapper that holds no, the No, 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 but I, I love myself. <laughs> so to me, I'd be a ten. But if I want to put myself, I would like, I, I think I'd be honest. If I want to put myself in the spectrum of like all people, I think I would be, uh, you say we can't use seven, right? Uh, yeah. yeah like, because seven is a hedge. You can't, like, the reason why they say that you shouldn't use seven is because seven is like a hedge. Yeah. It's, it's like, not trash, but it's, it's not, not trash, but it's not, fire. you're not, it's not taking a step out. You're there. like, yo, look, I'm safe. Look, seven. it's a safe pick. It's fucked up. It's fucked it's, up. It's, That's a, what it's it is. a safe yeah. pick. So, it's a fuck. So it's I would go, I would go. <laughs> Yeah, I would go strong just to be, because you don't want to be overly confident and be an asshole. Mm -hmm. You still want to get the love. I would go like an eight, eight and a half, eight point three, eight point three. What if you're talking to a what if what if you're talking to a female like that and she was like, yeah, though you gotta get it, you gotta be a lot more realistic. You're like a. a Five. So then, move away. Then we're not. Yeah, yeah that's me and you are not compatible. No, 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 no. no. Like a female. No, no, no. A female type. Talk. Like he's talking to a. Like he was talking to her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like a, a a female version of him mm -hmm. and you talking to me, talking yeah. to you, and saying like, "Yo." See, but I would what? have rated myself an eight, and then she's gonna shit on me. Like, well, that's your perception. Mm -hmm. Like, Absolutely. I'm not trying to date you. You in the shadows over there, bitch. I don't know what you look like. I mean, but she's. But I'm good. Turn the lights on. Turn the lights on in here, bitch. We're in the same suit every time I see you. Yeah, but she's like, I mean, <laughs> every time I see you, it's dark. You got the same suit on, nigga. Every time I see Sheesh. you. <clears throat> oh, you talking about the dude? Yeah, <laughs> you, you be wearing the. Nah, yeah, the that dude suit. is a. Is, he's a little bit full of himself, but I guess that's his. Uh, his, his style, his, <clears throat> his whole thing, right? And then, and then you know, but you have those kind of women. I'm sorry, but that kind of like that kind of asshole shit. There's so many questions from that one thing. Yeah, that I have. So, so I'm waiting to I see where like, you. If you have somewhere you want to go with it, let me know. No, I got no, I'm just saying. Do you, do you ever see? Do you ever see? Like speaking of that guy, do you ever yeah. see when uh, <clears throat> like guys are teaching? Uh, like there'll be like a guy teaching other guys on how to be like alpha males and be like, yo, oh this is God, this is how you like ever. bag shorties and this is how you get that's what you want out of like, to watch uh, out of women. That's my. That's one of my favorite things to watch on YouTube. Why? Why is men teaching you how to be an alpha male? Why talk about it? Because no matter how crazy the advice they give you, because their mentality is skewed. They're teaching you how to fuck, but like how to fuck fast. That's not really the the best mentality. That's like an right. immature way to go about it. it I, I wish they were teaching you how to get into a relationship or how to to spark up a conversation to get to you know to see if you're compatible right. or, or you're good for a relationship. That would be awesome. Very awesome. But they're teaching you how to fuck bitches. What happens after you fuck? Them I mean, What happens after you do all this fake shit? To fuck, that's not even who you are. Key like, word, What fake. happens then? Key word, Next. fake. You, you got it. I guess they, so they got to disappear, it's right? It's cool because there's truth sprinkled mm -hmm. into it. Mm -hmm. Because, like, for example, they'll tell you, like, uh, you know, uh, when you meet a shorty, direct eye contact. Speak to her uh, uh, lively. Yeah. Uh, ask her immediately mm -hmm. if she wants to, like, hey, are you busy right now? Do you want to go grab a coffee or, like, go yeah. get some ice cream or something like that? Right, no, not even tonight. Oh. Right now. Because if a shorty's interested in you and she doesn't really have nothing to do, she's going to say yes and go with you. Mm -hmm. So they're giving you they're giving you advice, yeah. but their mindset is so fucked up, they're coming at, at an angle of how to game a bitch into fucking, mm -hmm. when all, but but the, the truth is sprinkled in there because a bitch will, a, a female will react to that because <laughs> of your confidence, your tone of voice, your decisiveness. Let's go here. I'm ready to, you know, your, your demeanor. Right. So, so there you're, is, you're a lot more it's going to work, manly. but it's not going to work for the reasons that they're saying and, right. and for the intent that they have. It's, it's, it's murky and I don't like it, but it's so cringy and it's so funny to watch when the guys try to do these tricks and they don't have the, they don't have it together. Right. Mm -hmm. It's like on some Hitch shit. You ever seen Hitch? Yeah. Yeah. My nigga, that shit is the cringiest and most enjoyable thing to watch on television. I promise you. I love cringy stuff. Um, so yeah, there's, there's a couple questions I had still from this segment before we jump off of this segment. Go ahead. Uh, one of the things he said to her on the on the uh, during that little interview Actually, yeah. thing that they had was when when men look for women, uh -huh. right? He said to her, what he said to her was, when men look for women, they don't care about how much money they make. 
Mm-hmm. How much truth do you have to that? When you look for a woman, where is her financial uh, stat- status at in your like criteria for looking for? Is it there? Is it low? Is it high? Is it number one? Like, where would you put that? Uh, and then next time we have a female, I think that's a question I'm going to ask her directly. And if you have any uh, input on it, guys, leave it in the comments. Yeah, we'll talk back please. to you. This please is the kind do. of please shit we talk about, you know. Right. Nice. Who you asked? You asked. I asked oh, Crumb, but either okay. it's it's, right, it's, so no, it's for everybody. I'll, I'll go, I'll, I'll go Even first. you guys back there, like yeah, come on, it's, it's for everybody. I'll, Let me know. I'll say I'll say definitely not upon any kind of initial initial like meeting of like when I, that was something I was into. I mean, uh, <clears throat> but after if if I if I if I, after meeting somebody and after feeling I guess physically you have to be physically initially attracted to them. Initially, you have to be physically attracted to them mm-hmm. because you would like I to can't, be. I can't. You would see, like to be physically. I mean, you can't. I can't. I can't, I can't see step, your personality. Yeah. So, nowadays, so nowadays, I, a lot of people start on the internet. Oh, that's true. Through texting and typing, they might oh. see a picture here or there, but they don't. They're not around them physically. Mm. Yeah, catfish. Uh, so, like, but, saying, but I understand what you're saying. I don't want to yeah, sidetrack no, 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 you or, or distract you from what you're saying. Um, yeah, if I if if I. <clears throat> if I was uh, physically attracted to the person, um, not it wouldn't be an it wouldn't be something I think about initially. But if I started spending started spending more and more and significant amount of my time with this person, then it would play a factor. But not initially. When so, if you had a list of your top five things that you look for in a woman, where is financial stability? Oh, it's in the top five. Yeah. It's in the top five. Yeah, it's in yeah. the top five. Okay. I mean, yeah. Uh, bleak. I mean, I want to piggyback a little bit on something you said earlier. It's your show, talk about it. On on the on the comment with the guys who give the the videos and how to bag women or how to get them to bed faster. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I feel like that's also like a, a a huge. It's misleading because a lot of people that go for those videos are just lacking confidence in themselves. That like they don't need you to tell them how to do it. They're just missing. The fact that they can't do they they know how They're to do it. They're scared to do it. They're just scared to do it. So when you get these alpha males and to try to tell you how to get a woman faster in bed, I, that's just nonsense. Yeah. I think it's nonsense. It works for that person who's on the camera who's telling you this and this but and that. But it might not work for you. But like it's that. not gonna work for the next mm. person. And a, if it does, it's very on the I mean, but I feel like there also is disingenuous or it like, is disingenuous. like yeah. like yeah. fraud. Yeah. But it's like the thing I was and saying women before. Can see it. They'd be like, oh women yeah. definitely see through yeah, trying to act women tough? definitely see through all of that. Yeah, but some women might see through it eventually. Oh, yeah, no, you, I, you I, might I agree. get you might get the draw. No, I, yeah, like I, still, I yeah, I like that, I was saying, like I was saying before, like it's sprinkled with truth. Like there's right. truth in it because the the security and the confidence and the decisiveness that is attractive to anyone, females and males. Right, of course, because that's an attractive sort of trait. Those are attractive yeah. traits. So. There is some actual truth into it. They're just masking it in this scummy, slimy thing that I think yeah. makes it disgusting. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But what I was trying to, uh, like, you say that, and I don't want to go down a rabbit hole. Mm-hmm. That's why I think, like, a lot of this, and people are going to hate me for this, because I have a lot of friends that, like, are religiously into, like, self-help and do-it-yourself people, yeah, like, uh, self-help That's very people. helpful. And I feel like, yes, there is good things in it. Mm-hmm. You're going to hate me for this take. Uh-oh. But, uh-oh. Uh-oh. They prey on weakness. They prey on weak people. That's, that's what they the do. They make money off of you <laughs> teaching you how to do some shit that all they're doing is just they're also giving you their ideals. They're not just teaching you how to like, yo, listen, you're on discipline, so you got to wake up with this. Also, they're teaching you how they feel about shit, how they look at the world. This is the right way to do shit. And people just eat it up. They pay money for this. Well, they, for some, It's like a cult. Well, no. Nah, I mean, some people are genuine when they present to you an idea of how it worked for them. And then they just present it as like, you look, this is what I did. You can take it, take whatever you can from it. And so it can help you get to where you're trying to get. You see, th- that's different. There's general in the self-help books and in the audio books. And all why are you that, charging niggas wild bread for that? Because you went, well, you know, they're fucked up anyway. They're already fucked 20, up and you're charging them wild bread for seminars and all kinds of shits and steps and programs. Well, you know, they're fucked up. Look, but you're the nigga that's trying to pull them out of being fucked up. Well, we're paying- that shit don't make no sense. It don't add up to me. Well, look, listen. There's some that do act for an unreasonable amount for this sort of knowledge. But in some occasions, these people spend 20 years trying to find the answers. And they think they do. And once they do, they present it to you. 
So then if you agree with it and then you have other people that follow and also are and achieve the same thing, then you know that you have to now monetize that because yeah. obviously it works. Yeah, I'm, I'm not I'm not against making a dollar. I just, yeah. a lot of these things, it's, it feels like predatory. Like it's yes. mad seminars and that. the book yeah. and then the step one. And it's a step mm-hmm. like, right. my nigga, if you're really trying to put people on and it's coming out there, yeah, you charge money because, you know, you got to put, you know, you, you putting the work in and you did the work. Mm-hmm. Of course. Teach a class, do a master class, whatever. But these steps and these books and all this shit, and buy this package and that package. Yeah, it feels scummy, my it. nigga. Yeah, there's, there's some people that do extort. Yeah. It feels scummy. It does. It does. Yeah. But you can. I, nah, well, some people can't tell, right? Because right, some people are desperate. But for the most part, I think. I feel like you're preying on niggas. Yeah. And back to what we were talking about, uh, it's like. You're taking advantage of like natural weaknesses and natural not even weaknesses, just like you're taking advantage of of uh it's like you're smoke and mirrors again once again. Mm-hmm. Like you're not really confident. You're not really like relaxing in the moment. You're you're this is a playbook. It's like a, it's like a it's like you're putting on a it's a script. Yeah. <clears throat> like you know what I mean? Like, like it's, it's like script. telemarketing or something. It is. Like if if they but if, that's if, sometimes if this the action is a doesn't script. Uh, create the perfect reaction you don't really know how to really like audible and like freestyle it in the moment because mm-hmm. it's not something you're naturally accustomed to doing so some people are not good at left, freestyle you're like oh. some people need a script some so, people are not so good where would attractiveness be I think that's always number one Number one, I think so. Number one, I number one, so. I think yeah, so. I think, I think you're being naive. Attractive. You is that it would uh, some people might might say that that would be superficial? I mean, have, I mean no, 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 I didn't say a, mm-hmm. there's no. I'm not talking about a certain standard of beauty. I'm just yes. saying they have to be attractive yes. to the person because yes. to your eye. Yes. yes to your, to so your what would eye. be number two? This is a good conversation. I like this. What are your top five traits in a woman? Personality. Number one, personality. And what do you? What does that mean? I feel like that's too vague. But I'll take personality. Yeah, it's too vague for me. But personality. What do you mean? I was about to say intelligence. Intelligence. Okay, intelligence. Yeah. Two gotta intelligence. Yeah. Gotta be smart. What do you think? You say smart. personality. Yeah, yeah. Intelligence so what does personality follow. mean? In person personality I mean just a person who's just like her disposition. A genuine person, a person that's just you know, knows themselves and, and has a character that's not you know, I feel like you're rolling a lot of things into one. I am? Personality seems like too vague. Like it's okay. too vague. Like I, if you could be more clear like listen, I'll take personality, this is your show. But <laughs> if you sure. could, it'd be fire. Yeah. If you could like Elaborate. what about the personality? Like what part of the personality? If, you know, if they're funny, if they have a funny, funny. personality, so like, if they have humor. an easy going no, sense of humor, sense of humor. Two? Yes, or all that, of that. that. I think all of that is in the personality. I, I okay. bunch all of that. In okay, there. so personality for you, number two. Yeah, I, yeah. Number if you want to group funny, easy going, I think you can put all of all that, that in the personality. Under, yeah, three. Um, I would say personality. Personality. Because I, I put intelligence too. Three. Yeah, intelligence. She's got to be smart. Okay, so y'all have the same list so far. Four. I mean, it's kind of like what, what are your first the three? human standard, no? What are uh, your first you three, Where you go? Where you at? On that, Catch up. Top three. Catch up. Catch yeah, up on the top us. three. Uh, uh, we don't want to leave you in the dust. It's going to sound fake if I say it, no, but I'm going to keep you. it real. Uh, first, number oh, one. It keep it blunt. What? No, never mind. I'm only kidding. <laughs> no, number one to me. Like I, if I could be vague like you, I don't want to do that. Uh, I would say personality, <laughs> but I, but it's like more like sense of humor. Like it's like relatability. Like okay, it's, it's easy going. Yeah, you gotta be like compatible sense, the same. Like you gotta both find the same things funny. Yeah, sense of humor. So like it's like your mind frame. Like your yes. mindset. Mindset. Can I do that? Mm-hmm. You could do mindset. That. Number one. Just, Step one. If we are on the same page, it's lit. Mm-hmm. Okay. Step number two. Mm-hmm. I probably. Yeah, but like we can be on the same. Like uh, I know people say opposites attract, yeah. but we could be on the same page. Like yeah. you you're like opposite, you're like yin yangs. Yeah, exactly. You know what yeah, I mean? You exactly. yin yang me type shit. Like you know what I mean? Like you fill in my blanks. That no, still not counts. Oil and vinegar, but I like we like cats, but we still. Yeah, you feel me? Like yeah, make it work. You know I mean? Make it do what it do. You play the drums, I play the keys. Like play the you know what I mean? Like, we can together. We, it works. Play the banjo. Play the banjo. Play the banjo every day. Um. Um, so, so probably, uh, you know, second would probably be attractiveness. Yeah. To me. I mean, that was my number one. How could you say that? Number two. Number two. Because I've had the f- experiences of a lot of attractiveness. Yeah. And if you put that first, you could be in for a bumpy oh, yeah. ride. Oh, yeah. It could God, be a bumpy God. ride. It could get crazy. Yeah, you know that for sure. And then you end up hanging on because she looks so fire, and then it's just not worth it. It's not Listen, worth man. it. But that's young life. Bro- young bros. 
<clears throat> hey, go through it. Maybe that's because she looks good. I get it. Have learned. <laughs> I understand. She looks good. Maybe that's a lesson that that we have. Not all of us have learned. You ever learned that? No. Hanging on. I'm hanging on to dear life. <laughs> Be careful, man. They, you know, everybody watches this. All right, so we had three. What's the number four? Uh, I didn't even get to number three. What's oh, you're number, number three. It's true. It's true. Go ahead. So I said, what? Sense of humor or Sense of relatability, humor. Uh, attractiveness. Okay. Three, honesty, honesty slash blunt. loyalty. Woo, uh, loyalty, like, loyalty, like loyalty, that loyalty, honesty, loyalty, loyalty thing. Like, I got to be able to trust you. Oh, Like, trust. I know, like... I can put some shit in your hand, like, or give you access to some shit mm -hmm. that you could fuck me over with, but I need you to do some shit for me, or I need you to hold this down for me. Yeah. And I know that. I don't got to worry about that. Okay. Right. You feel me? I know I can leave you mm -hmm. with things that are important, the most important things that, you know what I mean? And I, like I don't guap. feel some kind of way. Yeah. Right? Or the, you know. Or Lou. Or the young, the young king. Yeah. You know what I mean? If yeah. I can leave you Simba. alone with my young If I can leave you with Simba. Simba. Yeah, if I can let you watch Simba, man, then, you know what I mean? You let me know. Yeah, man. Don't <laughs> let him go out running and shit. That's, that's the kind of shit I like. You know what I mean? Oh, I said it. My three yeah, we was... Had four. Uh, no, we had four. Yeah, we're, we're, we're at number four. So, so uh, four. Yeah, go ahead. I was about to say loyalty... Yeah, not, loyalty slash uh, respect. Mm. Like, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah, right? Like respect, trust. Yeah, trust, loyalty, respect. Yeah, yeah some sort so of So trustworthiness. Some sort of manners. That's the, that would be uh, the trait. Like yeah. she's... I'll tell you... What, what, and, then, and then five? What, what's your four? I mean, uh, men, neither. men could be some dogs. I think then I would go for like the uh, the classic intelligence. Uh -huh. Like, you know what I mean? Like, what we said earlier, a little earlier. We have pretty much the same kind of... We just have I think we're just orders. bouncing off each other. Just different orders. Yeah. I'll say number five for me is like empathy. The ability to oh, be Oh, you got to have a heart, right? But I think gotta most women do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think most yeah. women do. I mean... It's yeah. harder. For me, it's got to be harder for women to be... I feel, like, I feel like I feel like women yeah, are like yeah, when yeah. they get in whatever lane they yeah, get into, uh, you, you must not they be, be the best at that lane. Like, like, they can be the coldest women, ever, yeah, women be like, or the lovingest ever, or the kindest women be ever. Like going wild hard, like embarrassing men, embarrassing. Niggas. Yeah, well, you know what I mean. You gotta not put yourself in the position to get embarrassed. Yeah, embarrassed I feel like. We got to talk about... Let's talk about... Yeah, listen, man, man let's talk about it this episode. You know, there's some niggas... Why not? Let's talk about people that are vulnerable, right? So... Listen. If you like, a leech and then you you know So somebody asked me a question, right? Okay. Are we done with this uh uh this whole conversation no, we about yeah. uh the traits for women? Yeah. Did you go yeah, We did yeah, it? Yeah. We did well, the I, I said empathy, I don't know what y'all said. My for fifth five. one was like uh kindness, like nurturing like that. Like empathy. Okay. I like okay. that. Yeah. Okay. I like what how you, you said that. kindness. Yeah, so nobody said money. Nobody Oh nobody is gonna I mean, but you said traits. Didn't you? Yeah. Social I mean, status. Money's not a trait. Where's the social status at? No social status. Oh, I mean, like mm -hmm. she gotta, you know she mean? gotta be doing something. Yeah. She can't be just. She's bad as hell, and she's so compatible with you, but she's broke as shit. Does I that mean, matter? What, what it, she it, tries to get jobs. She gets fired all the time. She loses jobs. She goes on bad interviews. She doesn't get them. It's a classic story. You see that before. You know people I mean, like well, this. Does, does she have an education? She has she a like yeah, job she's, she's educated. Most the job she's do. going for, she has background in, like, at least, like... She should, she's overqualified in most of them. Oh, she's, she's just trying to get a job. Okay. Because so she could, yeah, she's, not, she's striking out in her field. Yeah. She's just trying to get a job, and it's still not... Yeah, that happens to a lot women. They're, we still they're, rocking they're, with they're, that. They'd be, we, they'd be we overqualified. How many women do you think would say the same thing? About a dude? Yeah. Reverse. Lawrence. I mean, I think less and less out over, like, the older they get, less and less. Like, the older Lawrence, you lost your job, and now you're on unemployment. Yeah. Wow. <clears throat> um, that's always tough for men. But you, ever seen, you ever seen Insecure? Insecure. Yeah, I think so. HBO. Mm -hmm. With Issa. Yeah. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Because a man lost his, his job, job yeah, and then yeah, yeah. It, got, it got wild. He's on unemployment. Yeah, but that happens. You, you know, it's tough on both It's dude. tough on both parties. You money, can't say that it's always on money one person. Such a it's, big it's tough part on both parties. It's a relationship, bro. Like, big, it is, of course. Because that brings stability, that brings less stress and kind of like, like, nobody wants to stress, you know? To be honest, that's just the way it is. Like, I know that us, as men, we kind of get looked at like, you know, we got to be the ones, but it comes with, um, you know, it comes with the territory. Okay. I feel that. I feel that. I feel that. There's so, certain things we can get away with when we do things. What was, what was that real talk conversation you was trying to get into? 
Um, yeah. Real rap. Turn the chair around. Oh, sit, turn sit on the chair couple. backwards. Yeah. I got a couple. Like, oh, I got let's a couple rap. And, let's and, rap. And, and I got a couple of them, and they're from like viewers. <laughs> okay. Um, young boy. Okay. Hit me up. He's like, yo, man. He's like, yo, it's young crazy. Boy. He's like, yo, man. Baby like, gangster. I got a couple plays I want to make. I just got with my shorty. He's like 21. 21, 21, 21. Yeah, I think, 21, she, 21, 21. I think she's like a little bit older than him, 24, 25. And 24, he's 24, like, 24, he's like, yo, there's Salah. a couple plays I want to make. And, you know, you know, I'm also paying bills with shorty. Okay. Right? Yeah. And I'm a little bit off on the plays. I just want to ask her for, like, I just need like a couple hundred dollars, but I oh. feel crazy asking her for it. Oh. And I don't really have no one else. Oh. You know what I mean? Like, my parents don't got it. Right. right. You know what I mean? Right. Like, and I don't have no one my that My brothers can, don't got it. You know what I mean? Right. So... Right. Like yeah. how do like like Oof, how do you ask your girl for bread? Ah, uh, you don't ask your girl for bread. I don't think that's so. how you do it. Yeah, you gotta f- fuck. He's asking me, G, blood exchange. How do you ask your girl for bread? You you don't ask your girl for bread. You try your hardest not to. I mean, you, yeah, you try. You need hardest. this bread. Like like, you never ask her for the bread. Like you never ask her. You need this bread. If she knows, you're gonna get the deal of a lifetime. Yo, Crump, you're my man's. You're the you're my nigga. I'm gonna give you this Porsche Panamera for two thousand dollars, and all you have is seventeen hundred dollars in your account, and that's it. You can't get no more bread from anything else. You need three hundred dollars. Oh, she got it. Oh, then yeah, I'm not. I'm gonna be like, yo, let me borrow three hundred dollars real quick. Yeah. Give me three hundred dollars. You don't get paid me. for not two weeks. Me. That was all your shit. Oh, I, I mean, like, you right, paid so, in another so, two weeks. So, what I keep saying, I keep saying, I keep saying, yeah. you don't ask her for no bread. Yeah. Because if you tell her the situation, she's gonna say, "Here's the bread." Yeah. A good shorty's gonna be like, "Here's the bread." A good shorty's gonna be. You like, never Here's ever. The bread. You never have to ask your girl for bread. She asks you, "What's wrong?" You tell her what's wrong, mm-hmm. and she volunteers and presents, it. She presents. That's it. what a good girl. But does. then, a, then a good nigga should be open. And honest about what's going on, so she knows what's going on. No, so yeah, gotta ask. of course, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. You, That's got to be the niggas' part yeah. on that. You, you don't ask because you don't ask your girl, "Hey, mm. babe, I need some money." <laughs> no, you don't ask your girl for bread. You tell her what's up, and then if she's good, she tells you, "Here, how much is it?" And you're like, "Yo, don't worry about it, shorty." She's like, "Yo, how much is it?" I'm like, "Yo, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good." She's like, "How much is it?" Three hundred cash, and she gives you the money. Yeah. My rule is three times. Well, you ask me three times. I'm telling right, you. I'm, I'm telling, telling you what it is after yeah. the third time. The third time. And I'm time. serious. And yeah, now it's like, yeah, $300. $300. Yeah. So let's get it. Wow. You want to ride shotgun in that Panamera? All yeah, right. Let's go. Sheesh. Or you want to drive it? You can drive it, shorty. Yeah, now we have a Panamera. Yeah. Ma? Drive me. You got a percentage. You know what I mean? This is true. Shit. What? Well, there's, there's levels to that question. How do you ask your girl for money? There's levels to that question. Because, you know, <laughs> if you break it down by relationship, you know, like that, like you said, that, w- w- is he married? How far along has he been with her? Okay, I'll yeah. give you this. You know scenario. what I'm trying to say? That, like, h- how do we make this, uh, how do we make this we, right We've been call, together right? for nine months. Nah, you don't ask her for money. Yeah, you wow. don't ask her for money. You fucking wild. It's going along. It's yeah. going no. almost a year. No, you how dare you? Nine months. You know, nah. we're doing, we're doing good. Even, she's gonna hold that. Good. She's gonna. It's not even that. your no. girl yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, nine a year, months is okay. not even your girl. A year and a half. Nah, you dead on that. A year and a half. You dead on that. Three years. She volunteers it after three years. Yeah, she volunteers. She should. If she hasn't volunteered it by three years, you should never ever ask your girl for money. She should just be at the point where she's like, oh yeah, oh but uh, also a good move for you is a good move for for me, me. and which Mm -hmm. is a good move for us. Yes, like. You should never ever say, I like yo, that. I need some money, shorty. Yeah. She should be like, yo, I see that. And I mean, I see what it is. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm not dumb. Yeah. I just know a lot of shorties, they see that and automatically, you're a bum. You're a bum instantly. Forever now. Now she's already fucking other yeah, niggas. Forever. Just know that. Yeah. Forever. You asked her for the bread, she's yeah. already fucking. She's already yeah. done that. She already texted Sorry. three niggas. I'm here to keep it blunt with you. They wanted this, you got it now. You asked for it, you got it. You got it. You, you, you ask that, your shorty yeah, for you're money. Done. You're done. She's fucking other niggas yeah. or bitches. It's a new, it's a new day. She's gonna tell everyone. It's a new day. She's gonna yeah. tell her friend. But that's what I said. Like it's based on the relationship. So if you've been past three years, if you married and you still kind of like doing this, man, maybe you're in the wrong relationship because at that point you should be in a partnership, right? Mm. So it's just like this is how it is. But at that point, most people share accounts. So what? Three years? 
No, 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 I'm saying that, that was a different level. Right, not married, 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 married. Right. But if it's not married, then yeah. yeah I mean, three if years married, and above, it even be an issue. Three years and but, above, like, five, six years, you know, you move in with the yeah. person. If you already live with the person well, and you still you? don't have a, a money understanding. Right. Damn. Which other yeah, money understanding is, is what tough, What about man? you, G? What about you? Um, how, are you, how, how, how are you Are you asking your girl from, or how are you asking the shorty you're dealing with for money? Um, just asking the whole so the way I would ask for money already is like I'm, you know me I'm a like a, a you like wanted a, to just leave it on the nightstand a, a outs, a while she goes and takes a shower just leave it on the nightstand is that what right? you want? just go in a purse but Ma- no. no like um, leave it on the fridge um, that's yo <laughs> your shit is fridge. my shit shorty you yeah. crazy right so I saw you, your oh, purse right there why, oh, why so use go, my I'm shit I'm just going yeah. in I'm no 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 I'll fuck with you I'll fuck with you go in boys you know what I mean? No, consent. We ask for consent. Consent. Uh, All the time. May I go in your purse? <laughs> I, I would, may I'm I a, borrow $300? I'm an outspoken person, uh-huh. so I would never want to ask my shorty, like, straight up, like, yo, man, I, can, I, can I borrow $300? Like, I would never want to do that, uh-huh. right? So it would be more of a thing, like, I'm a loud nigga anyway. I come in the crib like, God damn, man, $300? That's all I need? $300? Fuck, man. And then I already put I this shit on it. this shit. I can't believe it's I'm only $300, $300 away short. from that shit. That shit crazy. Yeah. To the point where my shorty would be like, what, you need help with just $300? Here, baby, you need $300? What you gonna do? What if she doesn't? I'm taking it. If she doesn't? What if she doesn't? She's like, oh, damn, she that's doesn't. why. Nah, then if not. I have to, so you have it's to gonna be her. on some shit like this. You gotta tell like, her. Or some shit like this. You gotta tell her. Straight Dead eye, crazy, no Yo. backstory, no nothing. Baby, give me three hundred dollars. Yeah, give me now. Now give me three hundred dollars. Baby, give me three hundred dollars. Yeah. What? Right what? now. Nah, right now. I need Quit. it. Like, baby, right give me three hundred dollars. And that's it. Like right. on some shit. Like, yeah. I need three hundred dollars. No, I give me. What if she's? A, what if she tries to take it slow? Like, yeah. Uh, what do you need the money for? Just, Just three hundred dollars, baby. And yeah. Trust me. What if she's like, yeah, I can't be with a man who's asking me for money. Nah, that's so, it. It's over. Yeah, it's over. It's over. Yeah, not so you're not getting the, you know, not bitch. Hacker. I could get a Panamera. Are you crazy? I mean, she's like, you don't need a Panamera. Oh, you're stupid. We can sell the Panamera instantly, immediately. <laughs> the next worth, day, it's only worth two thousand dollars. Oh, okay. This is a deal I mean, of a lifetime. Why is your man selling? Two, why don't you just trust me? This is a deal of a lifetime. Why, why, is, you, why is he selling two? Why can't you just trust me? I wasn't even supposed to tell you. Nah, money. Nah, to be honest, money plays trust. a huge that's why the top, trust. That's why trust yeah, is yeah. in the top money five. You see? The shorty's supposed to be like, what? 300? Here's 700. Yeah. Just in case you want Bring some food on some the dinner. way back. Yeah, exactly. Bring, us back Bring me back some wings. Get Bring some back steaks. Some wings. Yeah, yeah. some wings, please. I'll preheat the oven. Just hit me when you're coming back. Some canita frita. All right, canita so never frita. ask your so short Niggas, never ask your shorty for money. Uh, you, if you have to, then just tell her to give you the money. She should trust you. Young boy, don't ask She's, your girl for money. But yeah, young y'all boy, haven't don't. been together long enough yeah, to don't. ask her for money. Yeah, yeah, you're good. And if you need don't to, just say that. Yo, mm-hmm. I can't believe it. Yo, only three hundred dollars. Yeah, yeah, try that. Yeah. That works for me. I don't know how your personality is. That might. Be I'm gonna die extra. if I don't get this three hundred dollars. Yeah, oh, they gonna, gonna ki- kill me. Just get on the phone. They gonna kill me for oh, for three hundred dollars. Come on, I got seventeen hundred. All I all. It has to be two thousand. Yeah, yeah. Girl, so wasn't, that the, wasn't that the best way to get out of anything? When your boys dick called you for they killing someone or they fucking somebody? Oh, yo, I gotta get the fuck out of here. Mm. Yeah, no, the, that the doesn't work thing, anymore. The best thing, the best thing to do when I used to uh, work in like jobs to just to just always like pretend to act busy, just get on the phone, just pretend to be on the phone and be uh-huh. stressed out. Oh my oh, gosh, no, I, I can't believe it. it. Yo, I'm getting on that right now. <laughs> yeah. Jen, I gotta get out of here. It's crazy. That shit works for everything. Yeah, they're like, yo, go, 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 go. For everything. Yeah, so that's um yeah, that's don't. a good uh I don't even remember what the fuck we're talking about. I'm baked. Yeah, Blood nah, exchange. We keep keeping the- it high. Donations, donations. Donation. Don't send them, send them red lobster gift shorty. cards in. Send them red lobster <laughs> don't gift ask cards your girl in. For money. That's what yeah, Cheddar Bay Biscuits. Don't ask your girl for money or you're a bitch nigga. Uh, don't try to learn how to pick up bitches just to smash because that's never oh, going to nah, turn out well in the end. Out. That's a short game. You're Go out and do it yourself. You're not to spending mad money. Go out and do it yourself. Yeah. I mean, you don't necessarily, you can get the bitches to spend the money. That man. shit is nerve-wracking, but, it's, but it, it's pretty good. It's, <laughs> <laughs> what? it's pretty good? Yeah. That's a crazy life. That life <laughs> is, is fun for a while. <laughs> I heard, theoretically. But then it gets crazy. It gets crazy after that? It gets that? crazy. My bad. It's hard to maintain it. Life. Don't do it. Y'all heard about um, Casanova? Or do it and get out of it. Y'all heard about Casanova and G Herbo? What happened to Casanova and G Herbo? They both uh, 
are currently behind bars for ongoing cases about, you know. Uh, they, they got Casanova for, like, uh, RICO charges for gang involvement, like, gang Jesus. shit. And then they have uh, G Herbo for, like, scamming. And like buying like Lords? buying like ex- for, uh, ex- uh, expensive dogs and oh my God. Airbnbs and you know like trips and yeah. planes and this shit that was like doing that. currently or shit they did before no, cur- for G Herbo's current and oh, wow. and Casanova's been going on for like eleven they said it's like an eleven year case on them from like wow. the FBI so Damn. So, Jeez. so wow. federal that's not looking good that's not good yeah damn bro. Sheesh. I mean, it happens, right, niggas? Yeah, that was this, that was an opportunity, and it went. It's like something about they uh, wrote it out for eleven years. So, it's something yeah. about like how do these guys get on and make so much money and become these stars, and then don't get out of the illegal shit? Why wouldn't they stay on? Because the rap shit ain't really working. That's it's not why. really clicking like that. That's why. Yeah. I mean, it's it's it's, uh, it's, it's, it's blatant. Corona it's time. Blatant. Well, they can, like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of the shows. These aren't them, these, them aren't, these aren't stars yeah, who. Blatant. I don't think they can live the kind of lifestyle that they probably mm-hmm. are accustomed or like to live because they don't really stream like that. They don't stream to where they're making wild money like that. So I think they're like they're resorting to you know other means, but. It's unfortunate because when you get to like the federal level, they always catch you. Yeah, no, nah, yeah, that's just, oh, yeah. When the FBI comes through, they, they already have the case. Like they, they got the, the case is already no, they building the case. Yeah. I that's mean, they've they been, been building yeah. it for eleven years. Yeah. Exactly. So that way, there's no way out. So you have no way out. It's already done. Like yeah. when they come, they just came to get you, so you can see the the show. So you can see what they've been working on. Yeah, like it's look what we've been working on for eleven years. All right. So uh, you know, so uh, you know, that was a good question that we answered from you know, yeah. uh, young so, boy. So the young boy, we already know we talked. Yeah. Young boy. So I got a, uh, that money. gives me a bit of advice from that too. Um, makes me think of mm-hmm. something I I always tell to my my uh, young boys um, is you got to set boundaries with your partner, okay. and when you set the boundaries, you got to stick to them. Right. Because I've seen the funny shit happen. Can't cave. Key, when you cave in, and you think yeah. you're caving in for the right reason, you cave in, like they to give love. Like a bitch. They lo- they're looking at you like, oh, this nigga's pussy. He'll do whatever I uh, want. Just, yeah, real talk. Real so talk. you think Damn, you're like, oh, man, let me why be I gotta nice. be like, like that? Nah, listen, you gotta set the boundaries and stick to them. But why I gotta be like that? It has to be like. Why that. I gotta be automatically? You a pussy? You a bum? If I ask you for for money, I'm a bum. If I don't, I'm pussy. <sighs> why? It's the society that society. we live in. Society. I mean, big. also, you, control, you're dealing with like some they, immature people, man. Let's they want, fucking they say They want to it. be able to be, say they're in You're charge. dealing with some immature people, man. Because, God, man, you after a while, you got to, like, not want to be around that anymore. You uh, might want to just elevate and, like, not want to be... Get out of there. Yeah, petty about money and petty about stupid shit where you got to hide that you want to play PlayStation for five hours. <laughs> you got to... You I mean, playing PlayStation for five hours straight could be excessive. No, it's not. Why wouldn't you be sexing that's your lady Call of down? Duty, that's like four games. But why wouldn't you be like, sexing? That's not even crazy. But why wouldn't you be sexing your shorty down? Because he because he, he has mediocre. There's 24 dick. hours in the day. Oh, because he has mediocre dick. Yeah, okay. mediocre dick. They said if you play if you play PlayStation, you have mediocre dick. So, yo, man, the blame ass women, bro, that keeps saying that. That's that's why we have to lie. You feel me? This is why we have to lie about. Playing you shouldn't have to lie about hours. anything. You should yeah, you know, live in your truth, bleak. Living your truth. I do you like to play video truth. games, and you don't think your dick is mediocre? I don't think the tickets. You, what is it? The they've game? been stamped. Yeah, they've been stamped. The receipts double stamped? Are there. Yeah. You double stamped. I got a like a. I got a lifetime guarantee on my shits. Okay. You feel me? Shit is do real. Do validate bro. parking. Validate every. Yeah. Okay. Validate parking. That's Get awesome. your ticket. <laughs> okay. But man, I'm serious. The numbers man. is doing good. Yeah. Yes, numbers is good, but <laughs> subscriptions is high. Dealing with some immature people, man, when you're dealing with petty shit like that. I mean, I feel like that's just the way that you have nothing to say about this. About what? <laughs> Crump. About what? Well, ask me the question again. I don't mean to be wrong. I just, I just, no, I was no. just enjoying the. Uh, yeah, you just, oh, yeah, oh, no, just, oh, 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 that's just, not even fair. Oh, you just checked <laughs> out. Not even fair, yeah. Oh. He's not, <laughs> Oh, you just checked out. That's what. No, nah, I was just listening to him, but I forgot what was the yeah. actual subject <laughs> matter of what we were talking about. A half baked. Uh, that's not okay. even fair, <clears throat> man. All right. But listen, there, yeah, man. You gotta set boundaries. The boundaries. You gotta, yeah, set, you gotta boundaries. set boundaries. So, you gotta yeah, set what boundaries. Do what do you want to know? What are your boundaries, G? Oh, there's a lot of boundaries you gotta set. Like, um, like off the top, what what would be your first after two months? 
with this person? I think it's case by case, and I don't want to be vague and obtuse in my vague. answer. Like, Never be vague. So I'm going to try to walk with you, and you let me know if I'm going down the wrong path of what you're asking me. Uh-huh. Like, can she just well, eat food off your plate? Like, <laughs> like, like, I have food? Like, stuff like, like that. That's what I'm saying. Like, like yeah. So, something like that. I have like, Touching boundaries and uh, oh, food boundaries. I would love to know about that. And you're you're into nah, there's man, a lot of just, things just, like, never mind, never mind. and it, and it might seem jokes. weird, but that's just who I am. And yeah. if you get to know me and we're in a but if you what, have to like. What if y'all are out at a restaurant and she wants to try some some something that you have, and she just takes a fork and reaches over and grabs it off your plate? Is that something that you're like nah, cool boundaries. with, or you're like, nope. yo, come on, just ask me? All right, first. to be honest, I'm not cool with that at all. Yeah. Uh-huh. However, time time, I'm like I'm not an asshole. So if this is the first time that you've ever right, done some right. shit like I that, that, I can move in the moment. I can get, in the a, moment. I can get past it. <laughs> don't do that shit. Right. You know what I mean? Like, yo, I don't like that. Or like, if you want something, I'll get you something. Or I'll put it on your plate. Or I don't just, I don't like that. Me personally, it might be weird. I don't like that. So I, I, like, the, I, like, I like that boundary. But I yeah. feel like time, I mean, you know, kind of. Eventually melts down. Eventually that? it melts down, yeah, after time. So what? You after like a couple, you know, maybe after like a year, I feel like couple years, you already with this person. I think yeah. eventually she'll understand not to do it. Oh wait, wait. So you're not not even with time. Not even if you've been with oh, yeah, been for with ten other, years. Like, 20, no, it's a food years? thing for me. It's just weird, like certain oh, things. Like for example, wow. like okay, we okay, order okay. food, right? This right. Is different. If we this order food, different. like let's say uh, Chinese food, and, you know, uh-huh. they all come in the same container. There's three, four, five containers, or maybe three, four containers in the bag, right? You open it up. I don't like it when people open up my food. For like, especially like for no reason. Because some people like open up the food just to see it. Like, oh, this is the shit? Yeah. We already know what everybody's shit is even now. that? So we don't That's even have to weird. open it now. Wow, and then people are like, is, oh, this That's is what it excessive. looks like. That shit to me? That's weird. That's that might weird. be excessive. That's weird? Yeah. yeah, that might be a little excessive. That's weird? I don't, I don't know. I mean, if you yeah, don't know. Why are you <laughs> Why are you even <laughs> fucking around with my food? Because I don't know what's in. I'm you trying know to see what, if it's no, mine or yours. You already know what everybody's shit is, so the last one is okay, clearly okay. my yeah, shit. Yeah, that's why I said it's weird. So, all right, all right, all right. You already know what people know. I didn't hear that part. People know what it is. Give me my food, man. Got you, I got you. That is weird. That shit infuriates me. That is Or like, like, let's say like, yo, I have a soda. Can I have some of your soda, right? Of, yeah, course. of course. And then you open it and oh, take the first sip. Nah, I'm tight. What? I think I'm tight because of that. Here, just have it. Yeah. Just, have just it. listening just, to him just, say it. Just, just didn't have the well. soda, man. Just, you can have it. I don't even want that shit now. Is that weird? No. Nah. So I have like little weird boundaries like that too, along mm-hmm. with yeah. real more serious shit, but like everyone has their little weird shit. You know what I mean? Do you, you have some you, shit like that? You, uh, no, no. What question, you got? what question you got for me? <clears throat> I feel like I you had something gonna, lined up. I was going to say, do you like when girls, like, grab your butt? Like, I mean, you know how they be like, like, oh, hey, uh. You know how you mm. might grab your girl's butt when she walks by? Or a shorty you're talking to? What if, you're, what if a girl grabs your butt? Are you like, yo, man, don't touch my butt, yo. Or wow. you or you're like, oh, ha, 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 ha. Neither of those are my responses. <laughs> you say, ha, <laughs> I don't I'm not oh. like don't touch my butt. Yeah. I feel like I'm a gay man now. <laughs> like I don't do that. No, I'm asking you. Yeah. touch my butt. Now I'm gay. No. No, no, I understand. No. I understand. No, I don't I'm feel like to, that. I'm just trying to say, I, I, meant, I meant to just say laugh it off. <laughs> not it, it oh. would be like on some shit like yo, I'll tell you the first time you got that. Like I know like I try to <laughs> step outside myself. And, I'm not and I know your intention it. is not to be grime. You just probably wanted to touch my butt. I do have a That's nice cool. butt show. Yeah, I'll take right. I know. I'll take so, I seen it. So, so you're not you so you're not I mean? mad if she like grabs your butt when you walk by. No, a girl well, hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A bitch is just walking by and no, she I'm grabs my butt. You and let's say you're you and your oh, wow. significant other. I'm, I'm yeah, yeah. You, no, I'm we don't saying, do that. We don't do that non consent shit. We don't do that. We the consent I mean, boys. I mean, I'm Listen. saying your girl. I'm saying it's, it might be your girl or girl you're talking to. Y'all are around the crib. You're around yeah. your house. You're around her crib. Mm-hmm. You're walking around. I mean, you're chilling. You're comfortable. Okay. She like, I mean, like you're she walking by to get some drink, and she like, I mean, hold that. Pops a feel real quick. Hold that. She, walk by. Yeah, she hold doesn't that. tell you to stop and crap a feel and looks you in oh. your eye like, Give oh. Give that's that. mine. It's a meal. Go ahead, like that. Do your thing. Yeah. So you're cool with that? I'm cool with it. Oh, okay, yeah, that's all I'm saying. That's yeah, all yeah. I'm saying. I guess it's cool with that. I mean? Nah, you need a, a, an affectionate woman. You crazy? Well, how do you feel about that? If your shorty came up to you and cuffed your butt, this my ass, nigga. Oh, she said that? Yeah. Like that? Aggressively? Yeah. I wouldn't like that. I would get 60% rock. 
Sixty percent rock. Like she says just a, assertiveness. She says it like that. a man, though. It wakes up. No, just a, just, just turn the, the light straight, on. It's like, like the, light, the engine turns off. Give me yeah. that dick, nigga. Like, oh, why are you talking yeah, like that, yeah. shorty? Damn. Mm, I'm ninety. Where we going? I'm ninety percent there. Take me there. Yeah, that's ninety percent. All right. For me. <laughs> Don't gotta be mean though. Shh. She could look at me and I'm just ninety percent. <laughs> oh, just a look. Yeah. You like a Good. girl that you like a girl that says beat me up, like slap my face mad hard. I no 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 no. Like mm-hmm. you saw that video of World Star the other day where do you he was like, like the, slapping, do you like where that dude was slapping that woman like ha ha ha. It wasn't anything. It wasn't in a sexual manner, but I'm just saying like I mean like. Violent. That video was disgusting, Will. Yeah. It was disgusting. And how could you even bring that up when we're having a nice we'll conversation? We'll bleep it out. We'll bleep it out. Okay. So, um, so, have Nine. you ever liked a woman that didn't get rough? What kind of rough? Because you're saying, like, you said, would you like a woman that would be like slap you up and all that oh, shit? Oh, yeah. Slap yeah. her up, right? I don't like women that don't like that shit. Okay, I feel that. Mm. I feel that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. that's cool. Well, you don't, how do you feel about that? I mean, you you like women that like to get super slapped up. What do you mean by super slapped up? I mean, like, there's I, a I difference have a cape between, on or something. No, 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 no. I mean, there's there's a difference between like you know like, I mean like, and like. Oh shit! Yeah, that's something a like slap. that. All right, so so no rough housing. Yeah, yeah, nah, we're good. Okay. Nah. Nah? Nah, I'm to be honest. Yeah, nah, I don't. I'm good without no that choking. Rough. No, because it I mean, always yeah, yeah. So, I, light choking. Women I mean, are very sensitive. Oh, that's, you know, oh, that's cool. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Then you don't light want to spitting, them, spitting. Then they what, call the cops. What is what is, a, what is like Brian that. doing behind the camera? <laughs> Speed, like spitting. He's like. How do you feel about spitting? Spitting in her mouth? Her yeah, spitting nah, in your nah, mouth? I'm not, yeah, that's, I'm nah, not cool. I'm not spitting in her that. mouth? Her no, spitting in your mouth? No, nah. it's a spit. You, do, you down with that? Some sort of water play? You down with that? You're water play. With that water anything? play. Are you down with that? What do you mean? Are you down with spitting and getting spat in? Spat on? Yeah. Spat no, no, she spat, she, spit, spit, spat upon. she spits in your mouth. She's like, yo, open your mouth. Open your mouth. I, want I feel like two consensual adults can do whatever they want to do. So nah. like, and when the time is right, that's you know, and the, and the mood is right. So anything's down. Everything's a go. That's I never said anything shit, like bro. that. But it's I mean, between two adults, whatever they feel yeah, I'm like saying, their boundaries spit. are and what they, they feel is reasonable. Would you, would you be, uh... No, nah, never mind. Yeah, right? Hey, yo. <laughs> Hey yo. <laughs> of course that's welcome. Okay, so another question, another question my man's asked me is, yo man, like, my short to be one <laughs> Pegging. <laughs> Hold on. Pegging? <laughs> what the What? Yo, my shorty be at so so Uh-oh. so another question I had from another uh-huh. viewer was is uh he said, yo, my shorty be trying to make all the decisions in the household. Like, like she wants thing. to uh, make the uh, decision on what cable we got, like what kind like of package what, we get, like, like how the decorations. You ain't getting the sports are, package. How the decorations are, like uh, you got where that. the I'm trips okay are, that. like uh-huh. like what we're doing with you know with our kid and all that shit. Wow. Like, right, like how oh, we spend, how you get your how bread. we're spending the bread that wow. you know we make. You okay. and I, okay. like oh, both wow. of us make. Okay. Wow, and and he says, yo, I'm a fucking man. Like this shit is crazy. Okay. And she thinks just because she's more responsible, or like she thinks that she's more <laughs> responsible than me, that she should run it. But I'm a man; uh, I should yeah, run yeah. it. I mean, if he's yeah. if he's not apt to do those kind of things, I think you should put it in somebody's hands. And why not? And nobody else better than your partner if they're fully <clears throat> invested in the relationship to take care of that kind of stuff. If you if that's not your strong point, but do yes. you think a re- a relationship sure. ran by a woman could be successful? Yes. Yeah, I mean, like put in that phrasing, sure. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm not a, I'm not a sexist pig. You no, know I'm saying like it, a, a relationship controlled and dominated by the woman. With that, <laughs> <laughs> hold on, you hear this? You know, the like, relationship dominated. Yeah. <laughs> my ribs they hurt. <laughs> oh my gosh, yo. Oh my gosh, <laughs> <laughs> the relationship <laughs> controlled by the woman. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, my ribs. Yo. Oh, my. Yo. <laughs> do, do you think a relationship... A oh, woman controlling oh. a relationship? <laughs> hold, on, hold, on. hold on, man. Who want to fuck it? Hold on. This is what he. is this? Hold on. 
Yo, so. Next so thing come. say is a woman vice president. <laughs> because we saw that fucking SNL breaking yeah. shit. It's fucking me up. Uh, All right. So, like, let me ask you a question, though. Yeah, like, seriously. Talk to me, talk to me. Do you think that a, a relationship mm -hmm. controlled and dominated oh by a woman could be successful? All right, so what do you mean by control? Like, yeah, just, man. If she she calls all the shots, wow. are, they, are those the, the right she shots to, to call? Like, like I'm asking you, are they are they are they shots that you also would disagree with? Yourself? You disagree with uh, a good a good many of them. All right, like we're, a good where, 40 where are we going on vacation or real yeah, money like, stuff? Hey, man, like, like I how don't want I don't want this cable. Why are we? Why do we? Why are we a bounty family? Like, I want. I want. I don't like bounty. I like Scott. Scott. Brawny. Brawny. <laughs> oh, that's stupid. I'm not fighting uh, over that. I yeah. don't like honey Thank bunches you. of oats. You know I like raisin bran. I mean, why can't I have good. my own? Because she makes all the decisions. So this I is mean, not my relationship, buddy. <laughs> Out the door. So what, what would you tell him? How does he go about? How does he correct I mean, this? I would ask how it got to the point where yeah, she's controlling exactly. everything without his opinion and his yeah. input. Yeah. Uh, and if he he dropped the ball and didn't care about it, and she had to pick up the ball, pick up the fumble and run with it. Yeah. I mean, you know he I mean? he had it might be too late now. A couple setbacks. Oh, what happened? He was in jail for a little bit. Okay. Um, but since he's back from jail now, he's how no long, longer how long incarcerated. Was he in jail? Four years. Four. Oh my gosh, is she, she still with him? <laughs> That's wrong. Blessings. Yeah, she's still. They're still living. Blessings. Together. Count your blessings. Yeah. Count them. Yeah. Is she fully invested in the relationship? Obviously. I w don't really want to say too much about it because it's a real thing. Oh. But uh. Oh. Okay. Uh, those, I mean, they live. Scenario. To oh, it's just a scenario. They live together. <laughs> the way they live together. Uh, That's for sure. Yeah, uh, I would, I would, I, I think any kind of relationship that doesn't involve two people talking stuff out is bound for, uh, you know, turmoil. Eventually, so you know, if your woman made more money, hmm? if your woman made more money than you, yeah, and she was very intelligent at like right. financial planning and all that shit, right. would you let her make all the decisions? Let her run I mean, the she, relationship? She, yeah, that just because like if she made more money than me, that has nothing to do with the house dynamic. That just means that she has a career that gives her man. But wouldn't she call all the that shots? Mean, she nah, making she the big paper. She wouldn't. She wouldn't call all the shots. She's swinging the big dick. No, she's not. She making the paper. No, she's. Not. I mean, she's making paper, but she's not running. So then the she crib. can tell you like, shut up, little no, nigga. She can't. I make the bread. She can't tell me that. We getting this shit. She can't tell me that. We getting the Tesla. Damn. Nah, I hate the Tesla. Damn. I don't care what you wanted. We're we getting the Tesla. Getting well, then the pay Tesla. for it then. Bet. Uh, oops, I'm going to take the oops. money. I'm going to take we the money. We getting the Tesla. We're not getting a Tesla. Yo, man. It's a conversation. It's crazy. I'm think? not getting thugged. I, I just think people take... <laughs> when they say you got a choice, trust me, they mean it. <laughs> fuck. Just get out of there. Just Yeah, what the fuck? I mean, it depends because you it's know you got people. Because it's a no, living man, you got people that kind of like that. If you like you know that, I mean? then you know you 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 deal with that. But if you don't, or if you have to work your ass off to get back to the top, and that's what it seems like he needs to do. Yeah, I think you need to like focus on yourself. If, yeah. If you can't come to a a, a place where y'all both are putting the input in at least. Mm -hmm. Like, I think that's the, that's the, yeah, the bear. That's like, that. Yeah. that's the least you should be able to. Y'all like both the, contribute and it work together. Just like if a guy was making more money, but, I wouldn't tell you, he ultimately makes all the decisions in the house either. I wouldn't, I'm not You gotta be capable to lead and you gotta be able to do it. That social status. You know what I mean? It's more than that social status. It's just like actually just doing it. You gotta be able, follow, gotta be able to follow too. Yeah. Like, yeah. you don't, you can't be a good leader if you don't know how to follow rules. Or follow, follow, or somebody. some sort of yeah, some sort of plan. Yeah, you know what I mean. So. so I would say focus on yourself, get your shit right. When you get your shit right, everything else falls into place. Um, so in Facts. that dynamic, you tell her, you know, get your shit right. If you got your shit right, if your shit was in order, she can't come to you like that. She can't make the decisions with your bread. She can't make the decisions. You got your. You already have your shit mapped out. So get your shit right. So y'all saw that new Ritz cracker commercial? Yes, we did. <laughs> Huh? G, talk to me. Yo, my nigga. What's up? You Yo. seen that new Ritz Cracker commercial, G? Did you watch that? Listen. Uh -oh. Listen. Talk to me, man. Everybody deserves to have the holidays however they want to spend the holidays. 
But to me, that shit is some fucking bullshit, man. Let me tell you why, right? Mm. I don't have no problem with you being whoever the fuck you are, right? Okay. Could not. He's a parent now, so I'm curious. Man. Yeah. How do I say this? You looking right for way? the right words? Yo, or? I've seen. I never. Not never, because I've seen okay. this shit. That is not. How do I even say this? That's not that's not the average black person. That's not the average black person. That's not the average gay person. That's not the average like that shit looked like a fucking show, my nigga. Like they put on a fucking they did a production for that shit, nigga. They made a strong nigga with a fucking beard with lipstick (laughs) and and fucking dangly and eyeshadow. And eyeshadow, Eyeshadow. but regular. Like that shit is like it looks like a fucking improv. No. Man, you, yeah, man. It's they they constantly do this. It's like they're know? just. It's like a shock factor. They like, constantly right? do this. Yeah, and a, what? You can't say nothing. They're gay. Huh? Eh? Mm-hmm. Right? Two birds, one stone. For so what? We got a black person and in there, and we made him. And we still made fun of them, and they can't say anything because we're it's, yeah. we're holding them down. Uh, it blows it. <clears throat> Fuck out of here, an Ritz interracial. crackers. And I love Rich. I fucking hate Ritz crackers. I get. I get. <laughs> Townhouse, what's up? Ho- holla at me. <laughs> I get, I get tight when... Club when, joints. Holla at me, baby. I get tight when it'll be like the only black person on the show. It'll be like, yo, it's the only black person on the show. Yeah. And then they wind up making the gay... And then they make the black person gay. I don't understand. Yeah. It gets on my nerves. I don't, who's the nigga from ATL? I don't understand ATL? how the fat the nigga from ATL oh. with lipstick on mm-hmm. and his fucking taco meat hanging out his open open shirt with a from vest ATL. on. What are you talking about? The, he looks like the fat nigga from ATL. Like if he was just a little... Oh, okay, the okay. The gay nigga in the room. Oh, oh, okay, okay. okay. I don't understand how that nigga, nigga look homeless, with the lipstick on, right. helps you sell crackers. Yeah. <laughs> Does it make the crackers more delicious? Uh, uh, Ritz is for the, the, the tolerance, the tolerant uh, cracker wow. eater. I know nobody's going to say anything. Y'all let me just burn every time. Who, me? I, Ooh, you, I what said, do you mean? What are you talking yeah. about? I'm waiting for you to finish so I can. Yeah, all right, go exactly. ahead, Crow. Yeah, you know what I mean, I I said I could type when they they make it'll be a show that'll only have one black cast member and then they'll make the black person be gay to like kill two birds with one stone. It's like it's corny, it's it's passe, it's done mad times and it's lazy. It's wild lazy when like you know the the only black person on the show the only is Asian like a, person it's is like gay. a super stereotypical black uh, a super stereotypical gay person. And it'll be like, all right, so we're not even getting represented in any kind of like true sense. And then the 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 gay person that you're having has is a super like the stereotypical flamboyant the person one. where it's like, this person's not even a real character. They're a caricature of what they're actually who they actually are. Yeah, yeah, I would say yeah. That's what I would say. Like it's like it's like. It's like <coughs> oh, mm. Zaza, oh. Zaza, oh. Zaza. Shit, got me twisted. Got to the, hit Listen. you in the mata. Yeah, straight to the mata. Yo, know, it's like um, caricature. Like that black guy in that shit. That is not the average. I like listen. Oh, you know. I'm a lot in of New York. We we live in the New York area, right? Yes. Downtowns, fashion district, yes. all that yeah. shit. Like yes. You see every type of shit. Right. Yes. And during like you know special events and days, mm-hmm. they be you know yeah showing out. That Very is some much. not even doing it. He halfway. Like right. what? What? Like what? What look is that? What was that? I, I got both. I got I'm um, Look at this nigga. Alpha Alpha also Yo man. Flu. Yeah. Alpha. Right? <laughs> yeah, Ritz crackers they went for it. What you think? Good commercial? Fire commercial? No, but Milo. You want more Ritz crackers more, 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 now? No. No. But do you get it? Do you feel better about Ritz the company? No. They're pandering. Yeah. How do you feel? I um, maybe Who makes Ritz Nabisco? Whoever it is, I'm Who, not yeah? messing with it. Do you feel yeah. it? No. Damn. But I feel that. That was the only black person in the... In the commercial. In, and but everybody commercial. deserves a holiday, and so then, you know, fuck it. Exactly. It's just, I feel like they didn't even do the gay people right. Like, he didn't even... Like, his look was but crazy. Maybe there's something missing. Like, I feel like as a gay nigga, like, if I was a gay nigga, I would be like, yo, my nigga, like... Look how crazy you know, this nigga looks. He looks. He looks crazy. Who a straight, like, a straight man like styled gay, him? I feel like a the straight gay man should styled be him? outraged right like now. A like a straight man styled this gay man. Like yeah, a straight nigga. Like what do what do gays yeah. do? Give him some lipstick. Give him some lipstick. That'll make him gay. Like what? Man. 
That'll prove he's gay. It's a black man. He's dark skinned. I don't know how we're gonna make him gay. Mm. Uh, lipstick and dangly earrings. Nah. <laughs> lipstick and dangly earrings. Now we for sure a dumb person in the Midwest can know that he's gay. Yeah. All right. So like like let's say you had a kid right. or kids, right? Or yes. Like, you feel me? Um, the question that was asked was, how how do you justify filter? How do you how do you guard? How do you yeah, I even have to explain what they see on television or what is on television or what is just out there on the media mm-hmm. pumped. Mm. Because it's making it <coughs> I mean, it's you try, just a, you try and you try and you, in my, I guess, in my opinion, I feel you try and uh, shelter your kids as much as possible from seeing that stuff until like you feel they have the mental capacity to understand that just because you might see that on TV, that's not how we are or how we move and stuff like that. Yeah. You have to cut some of that out, I guess, maybe. Like, don't even allow, like, as much you, as you can, yeah, guard you gotta, them from you that. You gotta, like, yeah, not have certain channels, I guess, <laughs> when, have, when you got a kid, you gotta block certain channels, you gotta block certain kind of things. You would be a block in the channels type of parent? Yeah. Mm. It's crazy that when okay. I grew up, like, they had the option yeah. to do that, but they didn't some block sort of filtering. shit. And I felt like that helped You're not me. blocking anything? What? Not blocking? Yeah, okay. I felt like the, I, no, I see how it can go wrong. I mean, it depends, man. I think that But comes I felt with like age. the non blocking shit was like I got mad knowledge. I think that comes with age. I learned mad shit like from what? just being able to watch T V like and go to a chat. Everything life. Like, like what's happening in the world, sex. I mean, I mean like that watching taxi cab confessions, you're like eleven years old and shit. Like, oh this shit is fire. Real real sex and shit, like, oh, whoa, this is fire. Maybe. Cinemax and shit. Skinemax. Skin or Max. I mean, I feel but like... But it's a fine line because every kid is different because some minds will take that and they might get fixated on some crazy shit and... Go retarded. Yeah. You know what I mean? Never come back. Yeah. My nigga Bleak went crazy right there. So, guys, great my show. Bad. My bad. Yeah. Anything else? Right. Nigga? That's it, right? We did it, right? I think so. Yeah. Uh, episode 24. Thanks for coming oh. through Blood Exchange. We'll try to do better next week. I am chopped. I am fucking baked, guys. Ashanti it was a great oh. time fucking with oh. y'all. Oh, Ashanti versus Keisha Cole, who you got? I got uh, Keisha. Ashanti versus Keisha Cole, Keisha Cole, who you got? Ashanti. Who you got, G? Who you got, G? Why you looked at me like that? I think I think Ashanti got the bigger songs, but I think Keisha got the longevity. It's it's so Ashanti. subjective. So subjective. It's so subjective. Uh, Ashanti. I think uh, Keisha got better the album more cuts. Impact. I think Keisha got better album cuts. So you going Keisha? That's hard to. You going Ashanti? Yeah. Ashanti also wrote for Mad Niggas, like your favorite, J Lo. <sighs> Keisha got songs with Missy. Ashanti, man, I'm telling you. Keisha got songs with Missy, and and okay. women, and and all the all the all the Mad Scorn young young children of Mary, like Keisha Cole is a child of Mary J Blige, and women who've been through some heartache and some pain. A Bay Area it's Mary going J with, was going with. Keisha Cole, that I should have cheated. Those songs, like oh yeah, that? yeah, those just hit hard like, for shorties. Like, like Mad Shorties are gonna be crying doing this verse. He's yeah. like, I should have cheated. Like, yeah, and Mad, like, I should have cheated. Yeah, yeah and all and those, Mash. all those, all those love songs, like Keisha songs. I think are better songs. And that shit with Missy Keisha and the Whip. And oh my God, it's over. Yeah. When they play that, what, 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 what is, oh, Shanti can play Foolish. <laughs> foolish. Yeah, I mean, unfoolish. I mean, I mean. Ashanti. That's, big. That's why you love it so much. Ashanti. Not that it's not fire, but Ashanti does she play? Hit. Does she play Fab? Uh, so so that's gonna look out for that. So and see, even though to me it came through and redid it again because it's hers. Is she went crazy? She can play that. Mm-hmm. Yo, guys, Ashanti. thanks for coming through. And hey, you guys said everything you got to say. BX. Next week we'll be back. Uh, episode twenty four in the book. Twenty five. Twenty five. Benticinco. Oh, that's next week. But La Cora. Ben Simmons episode. La Cora. Episode 24. No, 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 no. Oh, you don't no like way. Ben Simmons? Nope. No. Nope. All right, guys. Thanks for coming nope. through. Holla, holla, holla. See you next week. We'll try to do better Shit. next week. Thanks for Let's pulling go. up. Let's go. And keeping it blunt. Ashanti. Hola, hola, hola.